hello guys welcome to this video i'm looking at activity 18a the question says you work for a shop selling office supplies called easy as abc using a suitable uh, database package import the file stationary.csv use these data types for each um, field of course this data type on the table and then some field names are inappropriate create appropriate and meaningful field names for those fields use the code field as your primary key okay so let's go and import the file so let me open my database here so i want to go to of course from uh, external data i want to go to new data source i want to go to from file and then go to um, text file okay so you browse let's browse for stationary open that and then okay this i want to go to next uh, first field contain contains a field names check that and then go to the next one mm, i don't think i need to change anything here so here i need to choose a primary key so from the question here from the question here the code field has to be the primary key so i want to ensure that that is selected from here so this is already selected so we're good with, with that so I want to nest it and then of course um, finish up and then hope for no okay no error here okay so of course uh, let's work on the table right now and then let's give it uh, appropriate uh, field names right good and then set the data types um, so let's go to design view let me open uh, stationary I'll go to um, home and then design view so for the first uh, field i think code is okay so instead of saying type of product to be sold hmm, uh, i can say type uh, maybe p type which will stand for product type how about that and i think type is okay so i i will, I will leave it as type and then of course uh, the next one the description of, of, of the product to be sold so i will, I will leave it as uh, description quantity of items uh, in each pack so i will leave it as uh quantity and this purchase price i'll call it p price something like that and then of course the sales price here i'll call it um uh, s price right so i think that's fine okay so that's fine for this for the field names so for the what's it called for the um code i will leave it as uh, numeric right i will leave this as numeric which is long integer which is fine and then i'll make this one long the uh, text just in case long test right um quantity what is quantity quantity is numeric too which is supposed to be integer which is okay and then um color color should be text to uh, yeah short text hmm. let me change it to long text whatever and then uh, s price s price has to be numerical and has to be currency to the small places something i'll purchase price so uh we'll go down to formats you want to make it a uh, euros and then um, the small place it has to be two the same thing with this uh, it has to have uh, yep let me choose this and then choose this one okay so the the discount let's see the discount okay this can has to be uh, boolean okay with boolean yeah that's it right there okay so I think uh, what else mm, okay we've done everything here so let's go save our changes yes yes for everything i think we're cool oh sorry i forgot this uh, checkbox here so let me go back and then this checkbox um i need to make it to be uh yes or no instead of that the checkbox so let me just put a text box this time around i'll see yes yeah that's it okay so everything is new also in this one yeah all right so i think that's about it so the next thing i want to do this is an activity so let me just um, close this 
So I want to go uh, go to uh, the file or the table. I want to right click on it and then uh, rename it. So sorry, let me rename it. Rename. So what I want to I want to give it task. Sorry, activity. Activity. Uh, let me see. Let me just uh, name it as activity, something like this, underscore. Then stationary. I want to have this as a, sorry, activity at 18A. Let me just have it as at 18A, something like this. And then, of course, it's, it's a stationary. And uh, let me just have TBL, TBL. So that, that that will suggest that it's a table, right? Something like that. Okay. So I will just leave it at like this. Just remember that it is an activity, right? So I think I'm good with that. So um, uh, everything's cool. So thank you guys. I will see you in the next one.